Okay, but I don't think I can clean up. Oh, have a good position. What's going on guys, Bizaz here and into this video you will learn most of the fundamentals that any player needs to get diamond. What you're seeing right now is a premium personalized coaching that this guy booked with me because he wanted to improve hard and climb fast. If you also want to not miss out any content from my channel that will make you climb fast and improve hard, make sure you like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Enjoy the video. My name is Filippo. Filippo? Yes. I'm nice from Italy. Nice to, nice, to, nice, to, nice to meet you, Vilivo. Okay, so let me let me share my screen so we can go step by step on your. Do you know what's a OPGG? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. yeah? Yes, yes. Okay, I wanna okay. I wanna see yours because I wanna look at some stats, man, and I wanna see you. So you play on L Vest, right? Yeah. Okay, and your name is like on Discord or not? No, no, no. It's different. It's uh, what I type it. Yeah, yeah, it's good if you type it. Perfect. Ah, I remember, I remember, Philip. Yeah. <laughs> okay, perfect, man. Okay, uh, I'm gonna. Oh, yeah, you have to update. Uh, I'm on a okay. losing streak, so. Okay, okay, so yeah. you, you need a bit of help, maybe. Yeah, <laughs> yeah because I, like, I reached gold for my first time ever. Like, uh, after I did the session. And after I reach gold, I immediately uh, start losing. I see, I see, Virgo, I see. Mm. Okay, let me let me think for a second. So you are a main mid laner? Yeah, I'm like OTP Ari. OTP Ari. And how much experience, like how much have you played the okay. game? Okay, I started when I was very young, but like for fun. Like... Uh, I think I was like seven. When you were seven? Yeah, but like I play once a month, like not so much experience. I started playing like serious law, I think three years ago. Three years ago. Okay, so you yeah. started when you were seven years old? No, no, no. I'm uh, like 11. Ah, 11. And how, how old are you right now? Uh, almost 14. Okay, okay. So you play like three, three, uh, three years maybe? Yeah. Okay, three years experience. And you only played mid lane, Ari? Uh, like in ranked, yes. Okay, I will just type my name here. Coach Andrew, um, student. Uh, is it? Can you write it down so I don't? Because I don't know how your name is uh, wrote. And it's Filippo, right? Yes. Perfect. Good. So Filippo, is this the first time you're getting coached, or did you get coached before? No, no, I get coached like I think the one year ago. But yes, this is my second time. Perfect, 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 perfect. So, what should we do today, Filippo? Should we do? Should we analyze a game that you have played right here, um, or should like, we just play a new one? Yeah, I prefer like playing a new one. Perfect. Perfect. So then we can play anyone. You know how to share screen and everything with yeah. yes? yes. Perfect. 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 So we can we can start doing that and then we can go from there. Uh, okay. Let's see if we have uh, lag or anything. But I think like, we shouldn't have. I don't lag. think so. Can you see the yeah. screen? Yeah, it's perfect. Perfect. Can I so, start the game? Yeah, we can start the game and we can go from there. Awesome. Okay. Awesome. 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 And what do you what what is your goal? Do you have an objective with okay. this game, Filippo? When I uh, uh, on this game. Huh? Yes. Or in general? Uh, both. Both. Okay, like uh, uh, in my single game, I wanted like to try to die less because like I think my problem is farming and I die a lot. So maybe, I don't know, like play safer or this stuff. Farming, dying a lot. Okay, wrote, I wrote that. Okay, and like in general, like when I started this, this season, I was like, I think bronze 3 and I wanted to go gold, but like I already reached gold. So like my new, um, my new goal is uh, or high gold or maybe platinum, I don't know. Okay, okay, let's put, let's put platinum. Um, yeah, I know. So. High gold, platinum. Perfect, 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 Filippo. Let's see, let's see. Farming and dying a lot. And why, why do you think... So, 
Why do you think you're dying a lot? So what's the reason? Like, uh, uh, like I think I'm like uh, I play very aggressive. Too aggressive, I see. I see. Yeah. I see. Like I when see. I see a fight, I'll, uh, like I all ten or like I think this is my problem because uh, like from my perspective, mechanically with Ari, I'm like for a silver, I'm uh, quite good, but I don't think like uh, the understanding of the game or the understanding if I can win or lose a fight. Ah, I see. I see. Perfect. And I see on Ari you only take Everfrost. That's your favorite build? Yeah. yeah. Perfect. You don't like, like Ludens, you don't like Leandris, you don't like... Okay, anything. like... Uh, I can play... Uh, like... I prefer Everfrost because it's like more team fight. Because a lot of time uh, I can like... Um, with When I charm I can follow up with Everfrost so the stun is really long. So like my team can follow or like a disengaged tool. So I prefer Elfos, but I can play Yandere's uh, Lutens. I see, I see, I see. Because usually it's adaptation. Like Everfrost is always good if they have lots of assassins or things that go into yeah. you. Zed mid, okay. jungle, uh, Zin Zhao, top lane jacks. Okay, it, it, they go in, you use Ever Everfrost to slow them or to loot them, and then you charm. That's a very good build. Mm -hmm. Of course, if they have, uh, uh, if they don't have lots of assassins and they have big range. Zerat mid, top lane they have, uh, let's say, uh, Jace, bot lane, okay. Caitlyn with Senna, then Ludens is pretty good because Everfrost, I mean, it's hard to hit Everfrost on okay, on, uh, okay. on Zerat and if you hit the charm on Zerat, you, he's dead instantly with Ludens and there is another build with Leandris that pro players like it, if they have lots of tanks, I don't know if yeah, they have, okay. because if they have lots of tanks, usually Ari is a, a pretty... Oh my god. You got top? No, but... Oh. Uh, le okay, let me teach like... you how to ask. Let me teach you how to ask. Uh, 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 okay, so can... Okay. Okay, I'll write it down for you. It's very good to be polite like this. Yeah, yeah. yeah we've been driven. You then, don't like Draven? Uh, no, okay, like I'm traumatized of Draven or Soul. Like this is my balance. Okay, 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 okay. Don't worry. If he, if he does, if he says no, we can also maybe analyze a game that you have played on Ari, or we can wait a bit. Yeah, like if you want, uh, uh, I can like play this game. You, uh, I think you are streaming. No, 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 I'm not. Cause uh, no, uh, before. Ah, before, yes, 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 I was, I was. Uh, like, uh, if you want to know what uh, is your schedule, mm -hmm. like, I can play this game, and uh, after this game I can reach you out, or, like, we can analyze a game. Yeah, okay, so let's see if he says yes. So, okay, he gets mid lane. No, mm, I see. So we can maybe dodge if you want. It's only 5 LP. Like, you're gonna only lose, like, 5 LP. Uh, okay, I can, like... But the problem, okay, okay, I can dodge. And no. we need to like only wait five minutes. That's the only yes. thing. So it's not. Uh... Mm. Do you think we should uh, analyze a game that you have played, or should we wait five minutes and? Uh... Uh, I prefer waiting, but. Uh... Okay, we can wait okay, and then let. Maybe in the meantime, we can we can look at on uh, some of the things. Yes. Uh, in your gameplay, okay. So, let's see. So, do you see my screen right now? We right now you should be able to. Yes, I can see. I know this is mine. Okay, right, I have to. Yeah, click, click yes, on your. Okay. okay. I can see you. I... You you can. I... No, I can't. Uh, try to click on my profile picture. Okay. 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 So now you see, right? No. Oh, okay. This is my last game, I think. Yes. Yes. This is. So you always go for the corruption potion. Yes, because like in my rooms I play uh, no how. I see, uh, I see. The time wrap, so it boosts the, the motion. I see, I see, I see. So you tried, uh, you tried also Doran's ring and these kind of things. Yes, uh, yeah. Like I try a lot of builds, but like uh, this is my preferred like standard. But I can change. Uh, I see, I see. Usually. Corruption Potion is fine in matchups where you know you want to trade a lot. Let's say against a Zerat, maybe yes. against an Azir, 
maybe against a, a aggressive Cassiopeia, like something that you trade very very fast, often, and you need corruption potion. Usually, the the disadvantage of this is that a ring gives you HP, extra HP, and mm -hmm. into a gang it can help you. So this is maybe why you're dying so much because you don't have okay, the HP of the ring. Okay. Plus, this gives you more damage on the minions, which is pretty good for farming. So you see already your problem is dying a lot and farming. It can also come a bit from the, the starting item. So, oh, okay, okay. I'm not saying it's bad to get corruption potion. It's good in the matchups where you want to trade hard, often, and you need it. But in general, probably Doran's ring is the optimal choice here. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see what you're gonna do. So you go in the lane. Also, in terms of the runes, you like uh, Futures Market? Is something that you go usually? Probably I'm trying this bit, uh, like this um, rune like for the past five days. It's like a new thing for me. Or I, okay, I like, or I play Future Market or, bi or Biscuits. Or Biscuits, I see, I see, I see. Uh, Futures Market is a pretty good thing. The thing is because it allows you to get items earlier. The problem is if you use it too much. Usually in silver and gold I don't recommend it. Because okay. if you're using it like this is an axe. Like Futures Market is very good. So this is uh, too much. This is too much using it. Uh, and this is zero use. So if you want to be a very good player with Futures Market, you need to be here in the middle. You need to know when to not use it and when to use it. If you use it too much, you lose a lot of games. If you use it zero times, you will also lose a lot of games. This is why, personally, I don't recommend to, okay, gold, okay. to gold and silver to use it because you need to be perfect at using it to be here, to be at, in the middle. Okay. So that's why I don't recommend it. After plat, mm, it's better. But in general, in this rank, it's not uh, the best. Okay, so you go in the lane. Uh, we need to avoid the E of the Swain. Let's see what we're gonna yeah. do right here. <laughs> I think I... Okay, okay. Nice. okay you dodged that. That is pretty good. You dodged the... Yeah, uh, I, like, I think mechanically I'm not bad, but the rest is lacking. I see, I see, I oh, see. Yeah. Usually well, think... when you go in the lane, Filippo, right here, um, mm -hmm. What do we need to do with the minions for the level advantage? Mm -hmm. Okay, I like... I... Uh, I don't remember. So, usually level 2 advantage, is it important? No, the, it's a question. Yes, yes, is it important? What do you think? I think it's more important on level 3 because I have the charm. True, true, but also let's say you get level 2 and he's level 1. Is that an advantage mm -hmm. or not? Yes. It That's is, exactly. Seven. This is why when you're gonna see pro players when they play the lane, the first thing that they do in the lane is they think what they need to dodge in this matchup is what? The E. The E of the Swain, exactly. So you need to kind of imagine, have an imaginary range uh, on the E. This is the range of the E. And if he walks up a bit here, then the imaginary range comes here, so you need to back off a little bit. But if you're out of range like this, you can auto-attack the minions. You can hit the minions. But why is it important to hit the minions if you want to get level 2 advantage? Because they die faster. Exactly. So this is why here, this is the first little mistake. You're not hitting the minions. If you analyze a pro player, he'll also try to hit the minions. This one mm -hmm. one time, this one on one time, and uh, try to push a little bit. And then here we try to auto attack and you back off to not aggro the minions too much, yeah. which is very, very nice. Okay, let's talk a little bit about this. So this is pretty important. Right here in this lane phase, I want you to, 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 uh, to tell me if you know this. Who has the level, who's gonna get level 2 advantage first in this situation? Me, because... Oh, wait. So what do you look at exactly when you're thinking about that? My minions and his minions. Exactly. So, what what do you look exactly? At? Like uh, uh, he didn't kill the minions. Yeah, like, exactly, exactly. Think, so yeah, think. we have more minions than he has, which means we're gonna get level two first. Do you know how many minions we need to get to achieve the level? Uh, two? One wave and two minions. Close. So on both lane, mm -hmm. it okay. is one minion wave, which is six minions, and plus the first three minions of the next okay. wave. So six plus three, nine. 
Okay. This is on bot lane, but on bot lane the experience is shared. You have two people. Yeah, yeah. So on mid lane okay. it is seven. So it's a mini wave oh. six plus one. Plus one. Exactly. Okay. So here, when you know you're gonna get level two advantage, you should hit the minions more. Uh, to try to get level 2 advantage and I want to ask you if you know that this is the seventh minion the minion that is gonna give you mm -hmm. level 2 uh, what happens if you use ability on the minion and then I you get have level the two? cooldown right you put yourself on the cooldown so this is why you should avoid hitting oh, the minions okay. with, with the with the abilities okay if you're about to miss a cannon or something crazy you can sometimes use the abilities it's not forbidden but in general if you can avoid it you should do it because now after this you have level two so you should trade now but guess what we don't have the double right now because we use it on the minion so this is why you should avoid using the abilities on the minions like this if you're about to get level two advantage very important for a mid lane main very very important the most important thing for a silver gold player in mid lane especially for you is lane laning phase the first the first 8 to 12 minutes anything that is more than this is more towards platinum more towards but it's not right now so we already identified a thing that we need to work very hard lane 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 when do we trade 1v1 when do we go for the word for example right here this would be a great great timing to go for a word but why why because the the mini wave is pushing exactly and if you go for a ward right now you're not losing anything i mean the minions are not even here so best player if this is faker faker goes boom 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 puts the ward right here and after he puts the ward he can play aggressive because he has a ward that protects him the best word okay. is this one a very good word is also this one is a very very good word never word the brush the brush yeah, yeah no it's like good. yes i i only I control like... only control word uh, you should put like, the word uh, like uh, a little bit close to the lane, but like from like to the right, not right. Mm. No, uh, okay. I know, um, not the uh, inside the brush, the second brusher. Ah, okay. Oh, he, right. Uh, so no, right here. Uh, 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 yeah. Uh, ah, it's good. It's very good. It's very good, but you need to get the timing right. Like now, okay. as you can see, we're wasting a bit of time, okay. and we could we could have worded and then go aggressive. Because here you wasted okay. time and didn't word, didn't go aggressive, didn't do much here. Very very important. Okay, we can go into a game right now to play uh, a live game. Yeah, I think now I have the solo kill. Yeah, okay. Um. Yeah, okay, I have to. Perfect. And you see, you still see my screen right now? Yeah. So in this situation right here, it's a very important thing. After you kill him right here. Wait, wait. okay. Let me know if you need help, uh, if you don't Yeah, see. okay, okay. You see? Yeah, you see. So after you kill him right here, what should we be doing right now with the wave? Yeah, okay. Push him true because we need to crush the wave so he's gonna lose the minions and after we push this what is the worst thing Filippo that we, sh we can do here the worst thing stay in lane stay in lane yes why <laughs> because we lose time yeah and he died he's gonna be in base buying items so if you stay here you don't buy items you don't do anything you stay no, no, here. Can't, can't, very... can't. and now if Swain is smart he's gonna be like hey Ari killed me but she did not recall. If she recalls, I'm gonna stop her and I'm gonna keep her in the lane because she has no mana and no HP. So this is how she's gonna think here. Very important, big, big mistake. The recall timing, the recall timing. And this is why we also, we also die here. And you see a good lane where you play better than this guy? Boom, we die. And we die because of the, the recalls. We need to know that after okay, we get the... Perfect. We got mid lane. This is very good. Is Ari banned see? usually? No. Okay. Uh, the only time I play different mid lane than Ari is they pick. Uh, <laughs> okay. Okay. Now the bans. 
or so because like you can lose uh, you can win a game but uh, it, like 40 minutes in and so 1v5 your team true or a ban draven because uh, like if he gets one solo kill bot uh, it's like uh, almost gg okay okay anything that you prefer anything that you okay. prefer anything that you hate hard yeah, so. okay let's see the match oh yes well. what do you think about this match of uh, it's not bad, but like it's not not the best. And it's not bad. Yeah. Because like, is it matchup like I can bully him on late, but like if I get a mistake and he gets a kill, it's very different. It's very difficult to play from behind. Yes, yes. So it's a skill matchup, basically. Yeah. I'm better. Okay. Okay, so. Perfect. So they have a Yasuo. How do you plan to play the one versus one in this case? Okay, like um, I try to like stop him from farming, like uh, push him away because of the range advantage, mm -hmm. and like try to trade. And they have in, in the, if I have opportunity, like uh, try to punish him with a kill, but like. Um, like the main focus is uh, like try to um, not let him farm. Perfect, perfect. Taking down his passive is very important when you play this yeah. matchup. His mm -hmm. shield. Uh, he also has ignite. Yes, yes. He has conqueror, no little tempo, so that's a big mistake for him. He's not gonna have uh, as much damage as he should. He has resolve, so probably second wind, but maybe, maybe bone plating. We don't know. Mm -hmm. And uh, he has a Shivana jungle, which is not the best ganking jungle, so you're safe. 1v1, mm -hmm. if if we just have a good vision, it should be easy until level 6, Shivana doesn't usually gank. And you have a Jarvan, which is a very, very strong jungle in the early game. Yes. Very strong jungle in the meta. 2 versus 2, you should win, uh, because you have stronger matchup. Oh, yeah. For me, perspective, the best thing is starting ring. Uh, in this, in this case against Yasuo, yes. In this case, yes. Okay. Only matchups where you plan to fight a lot and you need a lot of health because you they have a lot of poke. You can go corruption, but usually ring is is mm -hmm. safe. And like for the, um, I think Everfrost because they have Shivana that yeah, goes in. Yeah, yeah, Yasuo, yeah, Shivana, in. yeah, it's it's good. It's good. And we have like a uh, very team fight comp. We have uh, the Ragan What? Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. It's good that we start W in this matchup. Theoretically, in this matchup, we should be we should be winning if we get his passive down, and we need to play around his wind wall. His wind wall is thirty seconds. Hit him. Nice try. It's good that you hit the minions. Okay. It's not bad to use the first W on the minions as long as you use the next one on him. Nice. Very good. Very, very good. Beautiful poke. Wave is not in a bad state here. If he's pushing, he's a melee champion. So if you keep the wave here, it's actually pretty good. You miss some minions because you want to poke him, but it's not bad as long as you you get a significant chunk of his HP. I have the Q here. Wave is in a very good position. Very good. Now we know what to do. We're gonna yes. push and... Yeah. Okay. Oh, you can push one more. You can push one more because the wave is very bad. Exactly. The, the reason why we push is to crush the wave, but if the wave is not crushed, we can stay. You push hard and run away instantly. It's Shivana jungle, so it's not scary. Yeah. So it's okay. And then we Rico. Very good. Okay. Very, very good. And now we want to buy Amplified Tone and a Pink Ore, then we're good. In general, you want to crush the wave like we did. Of course, if you're 1 HP and you can't crush, 
you, you don't do it. But in this yeah, case, okay. it's fine to do it because you had enough HP. And you can use your W to get faster to the lane. We can also look okay. at, the, at the Yasuo. Yeah, he should see. push. If he's smart, he should push. Yes, we're gonna lose a little bit, but it's okay. In League of Legends, it's very important to to be very fast, to push fast, to go fast, to go like it's very important to be. Very good. He's gonna lose so much right here. And then this like graph. Yeah. And then I recall. Okay. Yeah, we can also get plates because the Yasuo just died. Okay. And we have a big wave. If Shivana is here, we're we're safe. You need to get it fast, and then recall. Yasuo is coming, and we do want to spend the goal so you can just go and recall oh i have the extractor oh wait uh, can i uh i now still it yeah we have lost chapter we're strong in general when you are planning to to follow like that people it's you can follow if it's very close to you but if it's not a close fight to you and it's far and you're not sure if you can get a kill it's better to just get the recall and not cancel because mm -hmm. if you cancel you stop yourself and you, you waste time and look at the wave mid you wasted a bit of minions because you try to you know help a bit so you only want to help if it's close to you usually but we go on the replay on that I so don't don't... Great, but this i think again yes maybe not. Uh, it's, it's... very good push here okay like now uh, i was from one lane oh my mr jump mm. okay. very good level we uh, can push so... we can push as well here <laughs> Because the, the Yasuo died, Shivana died, so you have a lot of time here. Okay. I guess so bad about you and I don't know how. Yeah, don't worry, don't worry. <laughs> We're here to learn. And then we just back off, we just back off, because Yasuo, Yasuo is coming right now, so okay. you can't take the plate, unfortunately. Um... Yeah, we need to recall and uh, get the item. Okay, if you Where follow. You now? Uh, I think it's gonna be good to get a ruby crystal and then boots. Only oh. ruby crystal, only ruby yeah. crystal, and then boots. Yeah. Okay. So, okay. so usually yeah. you wanna buy only the little components from the Kindle gem, like the the little red ruby. Uh, mm -hmm. okay. That, okay. and then you can also get boots for movement speed, so you get both of them, that and boots. Oh. Okay. Okay. It's very good because it gives you HP and you also have movement, but it's not bad to get Kindle gem because it gives you yeah, haste, yeah. ability yeah. haste. Okay. Oh yeah, so you stop, we can push hard here. Okay. Uh, I think I can let get the plate. Okay, but... And okay. we can just push here. Yeah, I think I can get two plates maybe. Yeah, let's look top lane, is Yasuo top lane? This yeah. is big mistake, he's low, so he's gonna look to recall. It's very good that you're looking there now, because he's low, you know that you can get a lot of plates. Because he's gonna need to recall first and then come back. Good follow here, they are fighting so we can fight here. Okay, there I think I can clean up. Oh, have a good position. Mm -hmm. Ah, other side. No, no, being the sick. We need to recall here. Pay attention to the mid wave here, so we can see how it is. It is nice. pushing into you. That's that's fine. So we need to rush to go there. I buy only boots. Thing. Yeah, and then we just go. Go oh, fast. Oh, I can fast. sell the Doran. Uh, no, no, no. It's okay. It's okay. Doran is giving giving you HP. You should sell it after, uh, like, for the second item maybe. Oh. The... Okay, they should win that. I think. Oh, 
Like, is he a bot and he's not doing anything? Yeah, we need so to push can... mid so we can get yeah. plates here. And I will double up so I can win the game. He's also what? low, so he needs to go recall. It's a big mistake for Yasuo. He's roaming and he's losing all of the tower here. Okay, nice. I can I keep can staying. Get yeah, this is good. If he's not bought, he should be coming mid soon. Yeah, but like I have five plates, I'm super big. Yeah, this is very good. Very close. We have yeah. a lot of gold, we need to recall here. Yeah. yeah, but unfortunately we can't because he's pushing, so we need to stay here to catch the wave yeah. Because you have enough mana. No, I'm not trying. No. Maybe Shivana is there too? Yeah. Okay. okay. Not that bad, not that bad. The, the no, thing is we we gave we gave a shutdown, so that's not uh Oh wait, I can like do this yes. and And you can also buy uh no 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 we we can buy we can undo and we can just wait for the Ruby Crystal. It's always good to mm. avoid selling your items if possible. Yeah, like this, you're very OP. Because if you get health, you're still gonna survive more. If you're gonna survive more, you do more damage. So it's not bad to get health. <laughs> nice. Even though you have a low farm now, you got a lot of kills because of the roam. So it's not bad. Yeah, I like, know, yeah, but like in the games that I don't have the kills, like, or I'm super fed like this because I have not, like, not so, like, in. Like 60, like I'm matching the minions. Nice. Nice. Oh, what the? Nico. I was saying, like, but I have six kills and two assists and a full power. Like, when I not so like I had in kills, I'm like very behind. I see, I see. Can I the word? It is in. Oh, what? Need to forget. Okay, ooh! Oh my goodness. Look at the wave, is the wave pushing into you? Yeah, yeah I need to I stay here. So. When recording, it's, it's very important to look at your wave, not at top. No, I think it's freeze. Oh, but he'll push. He's yes, pushing, he so we need to stay. Okay. And I'll have to recall. Now we recall, yeah. Yeah, because it's driving here. And I have the second item. Nice, this okay. is huge, this is huge. Can carry, can carry. But I didn't place a ward. It's okay, it's okay. We can put it after. Okay, now I don't think I have to stay okay. Why is he pushing this way? And I think. I need to stay mid, like I think the lane phase is over, I can try yeah. to roam. We need to stay oh, with like the with the most of the people, yeah, this is good that you go top because your mid wave is very push pushed, so you can always go top here. Like I'm the, think the strongest in the game, I can carry this. Oh, he don't die. 
We'll get the zombie. Oh, nice. Very nice, Levo. Very nice. Now we can go mid lane and we can push hard. We can add the Okay, but you can just push one more here. Like I put it here, or here. Uh, second one is better. There, here? yeah, yeah. It's more defensive. It's better. Yeah, I usually like for the dragon. I like put over here. They can rest right now. They go with black one. Now I can punish, maybe? Yeah, we can punish. Okay, I can set. I can just follow up. I'm oh, moving up. Oh! No. No. That's a shutdown. Yeah. You have to be very careful down. here. I think Jarvan should be fine here. Yeah, I didn't expect the Shivana. Yeah, we have to be careful with these calls when we. It's very important to be patient in this fight, like to play slow, mm -hmm. to not go too aggressive. So if too ag by too aggressive I mean if you need three stacks for the ulti to hit the charm it's too aggressive. If you need only one you can go in. But if you need mm -hmm. to know to do RRR to close the distance and hit the charm that means it's a bit too deep. Like in this case I can go all void stuff or all. Uh, uh, I think Zonias is very 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 good for carrying. Uh, yes, stopwatch and you can get uh, yeah amplified. This, yeah. Uh, yeah. I can um, I don't know. So the uh, you can, yeah, you can sell the Zorans and get the second thing. Yeah, yes. that is OP, yeah, yeah. Because you get the cooldown reduction, so you get your charm more often. Yeah. It's pretty good. Yeah. Okay. Good, so we need to play slow and not the, the, go too aggressive and we should be winning this. Okay. The if you bought. He's a ocean field, he has two drakes. Be very careful here, they can flank you. Mm, I don't think so, because two men were bot. And um, they have the ult. Hello. Be very careful with this face X. Okay. So now you should be staying with your teammates. No, yeah, you should, like yes, split. yes, you should not play by yourself alone. It's very bad. You should play only minimum with one guy, and that's the jungle. Okay. But I think, can we push this or no? Yeah, it's we like... can stay mid and be careful when you go in. Yeah. The worst thing that you can do is staying by yourself. You should stay with your teammates in mid game. Okay, like we are forced to suck now. Mm, but it is a weak recall, only for uh, black guy, so I want to stay. Yeah, I'm going top. Yeah, this is super. Oh, wait, wait, wait! Maybe. Mm. Ah, gosh. Oh, what? Very good. 
How much do you need for Zonias here? Okay. You have it. Awesome. Awesome. Oh, we are on for 20 SOP. Very, very good. Very good. Like in that fight, uh, okay, mm -hmm. you can like in that fight, my like, as I was thinking, like I ulted I think here from Shivana so he can't uh, run over me and she has to go the other side. Like it's a good thing like, yes. or bad? Yes, very good, very good, very good. Like, and like uh, I think when I'm behind, like not in this game, in like in team fights, uh, I like uh, buy support and try to like go in the, in the back lines. On and, the carries. Uh, yeah, and like support to a bad for much time. I don't know if it's like a good thing or bad. Um, as long as you don't go too deep, it's good. Okay. Mm. Oh wait, is it, is this is bad. Oh, the damage. What the? Mm. Bad, bad, bad. Okay, now I can go think or Rabadons. It's or... Rabadons, I think, or Void is best item. Let's yeah. press tab, hold tab, and let's see if they, they are building magic resistor, they are tanky. Well, Shivana is not tanky, Asu is not tanky, but Ilo is gonna be tanky. Yeah, and I think Nilo is gonna go some magic resistance. Yeah, you can go void, you can go void. Like in this, it's better to get this, yeah? Uh, or... You can get the other component. Wait yeah. a bit and then get the other. You have it, you have yeah. it. Yeah, you have it in base. Yeah, you yeah. have it, you can buy it. How much is yeah. it? Oh, it's 800. Oh, okay, okay, sorry, sorry. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. I thought it's 615. Okay. Then it was okay, better yeah. to buy the blasting one, but it's okay, no problem. Oh, okay, okay. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. Now we can win, we just have to play slow. The only way we lose is if we you go too deep. So you have to play slow with your team. Okay. And when you have an opening for the charm, we can go. Maybe uh, she doesn't sound top of her stuff. And we... Oh, what works so deep. Okay, okay, I can follow. Oh, Can I? No. We need oh, to yeah. stay if our team stays here. Yeah, Yorick is gonna go top. We need to stay mid. Yeah, good decision here. Beautiful play, man. <laughs> nice too. Nice too. Okay, this is big and it. No, this is too deep. This is too deep. I like, lost a thousand game like this. Yeah. It's good that you back off. We can't stay there. Very good. Yeah. Jarvan <laughs> is the carry, really. And now we have a lot of gold. Oh, Jarvan is 12 steps. Okay. I I'm just going to. Okay, she flashed on you, so it's bad, but not that bad. But I, I, my problem, I like, I didn't press the Zonia. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. yeah. I was trying to like save it for last, so I can buy as much time as possible, but like, I went too greedy. Yeah, yeah, she flashed. Okay, 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 okay. It's not good, but it's not super bad.
Okay, like mid is always pushing now. So we have so to stay I... with the team, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I have all the cooldown. It's bad for the sound. Okay. Uh, I can match top. He doesn't have like any magic resistance. You need to push hard and go mid lane because your team, if they fight, they lose and they will go for the Nasher. Very, very bad. So we need to I rush. Have, I have a like a little push here. Yes, yes, yes. So I can try to like get more vision as possible for Nash, so it's super easy. Be careful because they might catch. No, they are like four bot, one mid. Let's stay they mid, can... yeah, yeah. This is good. Okay. Oh, nice. Uh, okay. <laughs> we can like Baron here. They are all bot. If they don't follow, we can just go mid. Uh, but they follow. do. Yeah, so usually if they wouldn't follow, it's okay to just follow them because they are solo queue players and it's in silver. So maybe they don't follow. And if they don't follow, it's okay to stay with them. But it's good that you ping. The problem is sometimes they won't follow and you need to just follow mm. them. Nice, okay. you're, you're super uh, strong. Four items. Okay, I'm pretty huge this good. Now we can just go Ravalans for the extra damage. Yes, 100%. Okay, I can like solo kill this guy. Oh, nice. No, I didn't want to ignite, but I have to. Okay. We really need to go mid lane now, because if they fight, it's gonna be GG. Mm, okay. I can. Like, I'm good. I'm pushing like this. Okay. Because if they uh, fight they... and they lose, it's gonna be very, very bad. This is why you need to go mid to hover them. Very Bye. good. Bye. Use it. Okay. Okay. I think I have a good position. Okay, they have split, they have split. Oh! What was that? Wait, wait, I can beat on me. Yara, please. Okay, okay we can end. Okay, they just have him. Really? Nah. <laughs> well played, Filippo. Well played, brother. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Let's see your damage right here. I want to see your damage. Mm. Okay. Oh, 21 LP. Oh my god. Okay. Oh, top damage. Nice. Yes, yes. That's good. You did the most in the game. That's very nice. Okay, let me see the grounds. Okay, let's see how, how we could have played this game better. So Okay, waiting, waiting. Oh uh, yes, I can okay. Okay. You can see now? Yes. Perfect. So let's go on the recording. Okay, okay, okay. This is the game, right? Yes. Okay, so in the beginning of the of the lane, you played it good. I like that you try to hit the minions this time more, and you try to punish the the Yasuo with your passive right here. This is what you should be doing: hitting the minions with your auto attacks. And then mm -hmm. after you get a few minions auto auto attacks, and you try to uh, possess, you try to control for level two advantage. After you hit the minions like. Two 
twice or even three times, you can auto attack the Yasuo so you can take his passive. So now you should be auto attacking the minions. As you can see, you wasted a bit of time, you wasted a bit of time, and you try to hit the Yasuo. We, we cancel the auto attacks a bit. We could have played it better there okay. in that case. And now, after you you do that, you play it fine here with the pass. You take the pass of the Asso, you W him, this is very good. And the wave is coming into you. You didn't get level 2 advantage now because he's pushing, but at least you force him to stay close to your tower. And when you force a melee champion to stay close to your tower, that's good or bad? What do you think? Good. Good, because he's a melee champion, so if he wants to farm this minion, he needs to he needs to overextend very very hard. So this is very good, very very good the way you played it here. That you you manage the wave like this, and you try to keep the wave into the tower. Usually you want to get level two advantage here. You want to push a bit level one, which you didn't do. But in this situation, it wasn't that bad that uh, this wave state was like this for this situation. Okay, okay, okay. You try to go for a trade here, this is good, and then you try to kill him. You killed him right here very, very well. That was very good, and after we killed him, we said we want to push, and after we want to push, we want to recall. But why did I tell you to stay here and not recall? Because it didn't crash. Yes, so watch. So how do you decide if you should crash or not? Uh, the... Means like the wave state. Yes, so right now, what happens like you want to crash right here because it's, it's it's it didn't crash, it didn't go into the tower. But what happens if you are, let's say, 1 HP and the I enemy jungle can kill you? Yes, so what do you do then if you're low? There, there you recall, you don't want to stay. But in this case, you have enough HP, you have enough mana, so you pushed. After you push, you go for the recall very fast because if you stay, Yasuo is gonna have more items than you. Uh, the best positioning, challenger positioning to recall is right here, uh, right here, <laughs> because the the Yasuo, if he's gonna walk up like this, he's not gonna see you. He needs to be right here to see you. So this is the best positioning, right here in this spot, because you go to into the tower and you waste a bit of time. So this is why I recommend you that spot close to the wall. Then when you recall, you want to be very fast, like here you want to buy very fast and go very fast. Here you stay, you buy, you stay, you should go very fast. Like the moment when you recall, you should already click here, buy as you're moving and then just go out of the base very fast. Like here you are pretty slow, pretty okay. slow. You need to be a bit faster. Then you go into the lane and here we don't push, we build a slow push. We try to trade with Yas, so he's going very aggressive. Then we almost killed him here. We yeah, I think this is okay, no, yeah, He died yeah. and then you push. And here, you wanted to recall, but why did I tell you, hey, you can stay and get a plate here? Why did I tell you that? Because he has the death timer. Yeah, exactly. So he has the death timer, he's still dead. We have a big wave into the tower and uh, you also have enough mana and HP to survive maybe Shivana if she comes. So this is the reason why you stayed. And we stayed, we take the plate fast and then recall. Same thing, the best position is right here. Uh, you can also recall right here if you have uh, like a big wave into the tower like this, but usually this position is just very good. And I think, okay, right here. Was it right here that you wanted to, to stay? Yeah, so right here. You saw the Shivana, I think, uh, let me see. Yeah, you saw the Shivana right there into the jungle. So, in this position, from a perspective of middling, you stayed for the plate, you stayed for the tower, you stayed for the wave. How do you feel right now in terms of the time, the tempo against the Yasuo? Do you feel good or do you feel like you have to really have to recall? No, it's, it, like it's good. In, in what sense? Tell me more about it. Okay, like, because the wave is crashing. True. And I think like he like just spawned, so I have like 10 seconds. Let's see, let's see more, let's see more here. So right now, Yasuo is dead. You stay for the tower, you stay for the plate, and now he Oh, respawned. now, oh, okay, now he, he okay. So what happens if you move there and it doesn't work? Uh, the wave will crash on me, I have to stay. Exactly, so I'm not stay saying that 
it's very bad here that you Yasu is mid lane and you wanna follow the Jarvan. I'm not saying that you should never follow. You should only look to follow when it's very close fight to you. So for example, right here, uh, when you recall, you are really behind in time. Yasuo got in mid lane. Yasuo got in mid lane right now. So if you decide to follow and it doesn't work, you're screwed. So okay. uh, you should only follow if it's very close to you. Like now we have 1k gold. So you have enough mana and enough HP. So you can sometimes follow. Sometimes if it's very easy to get the kill. Like what do I mean by that? There is a difference if you have enough HP and enough mana. And there is a difference if you're following this fight right here. Okay. Boop, this fight. There is a difference if you're, fi if you're following this fight and you have enough mana. And there is a difference if you're following, let's see. That's uh, like it's really far away. Exactly. So you only follow the fight that is super, super close to you. If it's not too close to you and you're behind in tempo, behind in time, no problem. You can recall and when you come back in the lane phase, at least you catch the wave. Because if you move and he's pushing and then you die here or something crazy like that, you lose your tower. So it would be, it would be very bad. So you only follow if one it's very close to you or two if you know for sure you're gonna get a kill if not then you should have followed like in this case you watch the fight and you're like hey i'm gonna follow well since full hp it's pretty far for you and also you need to recall because you stayed a long time so it's a no 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 uh, let's not move thing mm. very important this is a very important thing the rotations oh, yeah i miss all my spells and then you try to kill this guy right here you you didn't play the best this no, very, very bad. Yes, yes, like, yes. It, like in this case, like we win two for nothing. Like we have got two kills for like uh, zero kills for them. But like I played so bad, I think like it yes. they need to yes. stay like that close on fight. Yes, yes, yes. And here I like that it didn't follow because same thing you have to recall. Um, and you got so much, you have no ulti, you have to recall. And the Jarvan wanted to do solo Drake, but it was a bit too greedy. A bit too greedy, so you pinged and it didn't move. Yeah, and because bot lane, bot lane was ahead. Yes, yes, okay. If you had your ultimate and you had enough HP, you can consider moving. But in this specific situation, not really. Um, the reason why you have a lot of deaths is because one, uh, recall timings you have a tendency to stay too much in lane now i think we fixed it if you watch the session one more time you're gonna fix it uh and two vision this game we didn't have we had zero vision it wasn't bad because it's against shivana uh, and you're pretty mobile after level six you don't need to work but if you play against jarvan elise zin zao twitch like this you will have to you'll die a lot so this is what we're going to work on in the maybe next coaching sessions, the vision score, where to put the words, when to put the words, what best positions I have to show you. So let's make a card. Let's make a, um, let's make a, a list with all of the things that we learned today. Okay. So let's see. Okay. So in this coaching session, what do you think are the main things that we learn today? Okay. Recall timings. True. So recall timings. Wait state. Like uh, when to push, when to crash. When to recall. Perfect. When to push, when to crash. Uh, recall timings. Uh, when to push, when to crash. Okay. Yeah. Good. Then after, like, uh, be like with the runes that you play, not play time wrap, uh, not time wrap, uh, Fisher Market. Because, uh, and uh, maybe prefer biscuits and uh, the atomization like if it's assassins it's better ever first or if like a tank uh, and this for those of you who are struggling winning and climbing a solo queue but are serious about getting better i also do coaching for players that want to improve and get their gameplay to the next level coaching can't make you better if you just play normals and arms and don't like playing ranked or you don't care about improving you just play for fun or let's say you just play the game for like three hours maybe four hours per week and that's about it coaching doesn't help you coaching can help you if you feel hard stuck if you struggle carrying games if you want to stop wasting time auto piloting and not learning anything 
if you run into a circle for a long time, if you want to find out the mistakes that hold you back, or simply maybe you have problems with the wave management, maybe you feel lost throughout the mid game, maybe you struggle with the decision making, macro, and you just want to learn how to do it properly from a professional coach. Or let's say you have difficulties checking the enemy jungle and you die a lot to ganks. Or simply maybe you just want to learn how to carry one versus nine so you can actually climb and stop really wasting time. So what are you waiting for? Go ahead and book your own coaching now and start improving instantly. I'll see you in the session.